Well, this unusually warm weather is causing some plants and trees to bud before they should. Uh, take a look at the buds on this apple tree. They're starting to open up right now, and garlic is sprouting from the ground months early. A lot of plants in Kansas City's community garden are confused by this warm weather. So Chris, the manager at Earl May Garden Center in Shawnee, is here to tell us what to expect this season and if you should be worried if, if some stuff's budding or, or maybe even opening up. Um, should folks be worried if they're seeing that, uh, you know, their tree is budding? You know, budding is normal, and I wouldn't worry too much about it. Uh, the trees are smart. Mother Nature's going to take care of things. These buds are really durable little creatures. They, uh, they know when to open up, and mm -hmm. these cold nights are really going to make a big difference on how tight those buds stay. Are these plants confused? They are. They are a little bit confused, particularly some of the bulbs that are blooming. Mm -hmm. We had uh, one of our landscape partners from Prairie Scapes, Nathan Jones, was out in the field yesterday. He took some photos that you guys, I think, are showing yeah. now of uh, some, of the, some of the bulbs that are coming up. And, and what is this one that's coming up? That's actually some cat mint, uh, and it's one of the perennials that didn't fully go into dormancy. Oh, wow. And, and usually that's already dormant by now, and this is something that's already sprouting. Yeah, and those are, those are daffodils, and wow. those are coming up. And like I said, you shouldn't be too worried about those okay. because that foliage will die back once it gets cold. The snow's going to cover them up. Yeah. We might see some, a few less leaves on those plants, but they'll still flower. Okay. So even if it does maybe flower or bloom right now, it still will in the spring. You know, if it does flower now, uh, it likely wouldn't in okay. the spring. That would but, be it. But right now, I'm thinking it's that, not gonna uh, that it's not going to happen. Yeah. Unless we have more days like this. Well, yeah, if they continued, yeah. uh, it, uh, there's, a, there's a good possibility of it. Definitely not in the forecast because yeah. we know that snow will come. As you, as you know, it is winter. Let's talk about that because um, folks may be wondering, all right, the winter months, they're here. It's cold outside. The snow is going to be coming one day. It will be coming. Um, what can they do to protect their plants? You know, that's a great question, and I'm really glad you guys are covering this story. The best thing to do right now is water your plants, especially the newly established or, or newly Still. planted ones. Yeah. Okay. Uh, take advantage of this, this afternoon's great weather. Yeah. And Go out there and water your newly planted trees and shrubs and uh, even your perennials that are yeah. in the ground. It'll make a big difference for them. Right. And that'll help protect them from some of the harsh winter conditions that we know are coming. Yeah. I mean, they, right. they are without a doubt. All right. And then you can use something like this. And what is this? And this is uh, a cover to protect tree bark and especially put it on uh, newly planted crab apples or not quite established maples. Okay. That'll prevent uh, sun scald Perfect. when the sun reflects off the snow. Perfect. Some good information. And uh, this is Chris with Earl May out of Shawnee. Uh, he's a landscaping expert, and we appreciate you being here and, and letting us know it's okay if you see the buds out right now. If they start blooming, then it's a different story, though.